All right, welcome to Justin's Fishing Adventures. We're at Willow Beach. Today is Wednesday. It's January 18th? 19th. January 19th. We got a crawfish right here. We haven't been getting a lot of bites. We got one catfish so far, and we see some big trout swimming around. We know there's stripers around, so we're gonna go ahead and hook this crawdad that my buddy caught, and we're gonna try it out for live bait, because a lot of the stripers that I've caught this year actually have these in their belly. They don't have the trout. They have these in their belly. They eat the trout, yes, but these are the main food source up here for these stripers. So I'm gonna show you guys how to use these and how to rig these, okay? I have a circle hook right here, pretty good size, okay? I'm not sure what size, I think it's a four or five, to be honest with you. Now I'm gonna take it. I have the last thread in the tail right there. I'm gonna start right there. I'm gonna hook him like so. I'm gonna go up about three to four shells. I'm gonna punch it through just like that. Now it's gonna stay on really well and keep him alive. You want that, you want that crawfish to stay alive, okay? Especially when you're fishing game fish. Now I have a three foot leader with 25 pound fluorocarbon with a one ounce ink seeker, okay? With braided line, 50 pound braid. But I'm using, the important part is, is the fluorocarbon leader. You do not want to see the fish to see the braid. So we're gonna try this out. Uh, so please if you like and subscribe, Justin's Fishing Adventures, if you like my tips and tricks, and hopefully, uh, See you out here fishing soon. Thanks for tuning in.